So, what's the difference between wild foods and organic foods? Organic foods is usually grown in farm soil that's been used for the last hundred years and there's very little nutrition left in that soil. And those farms are usually watered by municipal water, which usually has fluoride and chlorine in it, two of the most toxic substances known to man. And the plants are wimpy because they know they're going to get watered every day, so they don't have to try very hard to live. Their roots don't go very deep. Whereas wild plants, those weeds that grow in your sidewalk, they don't get watered every day. They have to survive. They're very tough. They grow roots sometimes literally hundreds of feet deep. Not just to get water. The more I learn about weeds, the more fascinated I am by them. Wherever man goes, weeds follow. What is the purpose of weeds? Well, wherever man goes, he messes up the soil. He compacts it, puts cement on it. He just destroys it. Weeds are like the commandos of the plant world. They come in wherever there's distressed soil. The first thing they do is they start spreading roots out everywhere. The top layer of roots starts breaking up the top soil, and then they drop this really long, deep taproot, which goes literally hundreds of feet down into the ground and starts sucking up all that nutrition from deep, deep, deep in the ground, which fills the plant with saponins, sterols, alkaloids, glycosides, resins, minerals, trace minerals, and vitamins, and brings it all up to the top and starts spreading it out into the topsoil that is breaking up, which starts regenerating the topsoil. And the plant itself is super rich in all these minerals. If you eat this plant, you're going to be getting a thousand times the nutrition of what you would get from an organic plant grown on a farm. These wild plants are literally the super food of the planet. And they're free. They don't cost anything. Matter of fact, they don't even need you. You need them.